undergoing open heart surgery 10 years ago. James Fain changed his ways. I try to make sure that most of the things that I eat or buy are relatively healthy for me. I do read the, the labels. Trans fats are something he chooses to live without. What they are is, is, the, is, the, hardening, is the hardening fats that, that get into your veins. Trans fats um, are chemically modified oils. So you start out with a vegetable oil and it, it goes through a chemical modification where they actually add these hydrogen molecules to it. It's almost like a preservative. It changes the texture and the flavor of the foods. The trouble with trans fat, it increases the risk of heart disease. The FDA believes banning it could prevent 20,000 heart attacks and 7,000 deaths from heart disease each year. So the agency is taking steps to eliminate it from the U.S. food supply. We know that trans fat that's cause cardiovascular disease. So we have to be able to say we can't expose our population. Trans fat is already being phased out, but it's still found in some brands of microwave popcorn, frozen pizzas, margarines, canned frosting, and coffee creamers, which may prompt more people to read labels. The more foods are processed, and the more they change, the more unhealthy they become. Removing these unnatural fats from our diet shouldn't leave anyone heartbroken. For Leave Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.